Hi, this is Rebecca from Chemnitz, and I'm here today to talk to you about a question I frequently get on this channel. People often wonder if yarn dyed with food coloring is color fast and if it's light fast. I have already demonstrated on another video on this channel that yarn dyed with food coloring is color fast. I knit and washed a swatch in the washing machine with laundry detergent of yarn that had been dyed with food coloring and we saw no color loss at all, um, which means that the color is stable. But what about light fastness? Light fast, would, a color that is light fast would not fade over time. I knit the wings of this butterfly with some hand dyed yarn and the, the body was knit with a commercially dyed yarn. And then I left it on my windowsill as decoration for months. So it, this was in direct sunlight every day for months at a time. And there is still, you know, a lot of color in the wing. But if you look at the wrong side of the wings, you can see how much brighter the color was originally. You can and will get fading if you leave your hand dyed knits in direct sunlight um, over time. In contrast, I want to show you some knit winter accessories. I knit this hat and these mittens with some of the first yarn, the first 100% wool yarn I ever dyed with food coloring and Kool-Aid. And I wear these very frequently in the winter, which involves me going outside in direct sunlight. Um, but even just from looking at the inside, at the vibrancy of the colors, there is no observable change. So what does this mean about the light fastness of yarn dyed with food coloring based dyes? It means that you will experience some fading if you leave these objects in direct sunlight. But if you just use them as you would normal accessories, then you are likely to maintain the beautiful vibrant colors you achieved with these methods. So is it light fast? No. Would I worry about it? Not really. Just make sure you put your items away. I do leave them, like I don't hide my accessories in a closet or everything after every time I wear them, I just don't leave them on a windowsill um, where they are getting the direct sun exposure. So I think that normal use items should be perfectly fine. Thank you for taking the time to ask me questions and I hope that this helped. I am Rebecca from Chemnitz and I hope that this helps encourage you to start some dyeing.